Hey there, Walter here. I was excited because I had ordered something from eBay and I just picked it up at the mailbox and I'm not sure if I'm excited about it. So this is going to be my opening. This is supposed to be spy glasses, similar to a spy pen that I have. Spy being, I have a pen that has a camera and a microphone built into it. So it basically seems like an audio video device. And these are supposed to be glasses, which are the same thing. But I'm not sure if that's what it is, so we're going to do a little opening here and find out. See how happy I am with this. According to this uh, description here, it says that the description is a card pen. I don't think that's right, so we're going to find out. I just have to figure out how to open this. That doesn't seem to want to open too well, so... I have to go with an alternative method. That works. Okay. What do we have in here? We have a bag. Just a regular bag. Aha! There we go. I think I was wrong about this thing. Because it's all packaged up in one small package. Why do they make these things so difficult to open? There, that works. A cleaning cloth. I can see you! Instruction booklet. Hey, here we go. HD camera eyewear. The user manual. Interesting. This is in English. In Chinese. Charging cable. I have a few of these already, so this will work. And this is set up for the smartphone, so I can charge this with anything. Here's the glasses right here. Alright, I gotta check this out. How do I look? Weird? A nerd? Well, with the glasses here, they're in a pretty nice fit. Although I need to see if they have any prescription lenses that can be put into these things because right now I have to wear glasses, obviously. And right now, looking at the video display on the camera, it's a blur of colors. I, mean, I can see an outline shape of myself, but everything else is a blur. Until now. All right. Let's take a look at this stuff. Okay, I'm not. I'm not disappointed. Not at all. No. No, 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 not disappointed. This is good. I like this. So let's read the uh, instructions of this thing here. I'm trying to figure out how to read this stuff here and how to get this to start. I need to put my knife away here. Always have a knife with you. Wherever you go, comes in handy all the time. Remember that. To start the device, press and hold the on-off button for two seconds, and then release. Red light indicator will light up. The device is in standby mode. Remember the uh, spy pen I was talking about earlier? This is it right here. Simple spy pen. We have a camera right in the front here, right above the uh, pocket clip. Microphone is in here, somewhere inside the space where the pocket clip goes. And two lights in the back here. Actually, I think this one on the bottom might be the uh, might be either a reset or the uh, microphone itself. I don't know. I know this top one is a light, but we're not going to talk about the spy pen right now because we're talking about the spy glasses. Although when I open this up, yeah, you can actually write with this because of an ink cartridge, and in here you have your electronic doodads and whatever. And I'm just going to pull the memory card out of this. I know what you're saying. Stop talking about the stupid pen. Okay, closing this up, I see that 
this side here has room for a memory card. So I will open this up and close just this side right here and then just try to pop this in and see if it works. I can't get that to go any further so I think that's the farthest it's going to go. Let me turn the light here and we'll show you. Yeah, I think that's the farthest that this uh, memory card is going to go. Start device, press and hold the on off button for two seconds and then release. One, two, there is a red light on here. I don't know if you can see it, but there is a red light. Okay. Okay, I think I got these figured out here. I think what you have to do is with this uh, large button that's over here on the side. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, I should turn this over. With this button over here, you can see the light. You basically push it in real quick and it took a picture. And then take it again, another picture. Take it again, another picture. Let's try something else here. Take another picture. Take another picture. Now, to record, you hold this down for three seconds. Okay, it blinks, then the light goes off. It's recording. From what I understand, these glasses are recording right now. And from what I also understand, the recording is coming from this side right here. So I don't know if it's correct or not. We'll find out. Stop the recording. You push this button once. And it goes to your standby mode. Okay, turn these off. You go into the recording mode. It's recording. You hold the button in for two seconds, I think. Okay, there's a blue light that went on. Now the blue light went out. Nothing's happening. So everything is saved, or should be saved. Okay, the only thing I find troubling about this is if you want to record somebody, uh, you have to look pretty conspicuous doing it because you just push a button right here just to take a photo or hold it in to take a video. So it's pretty obvious that's going to happen. I think what they should have done was put the button on the outside but that could make it kind of conspicuous too or they could put it on the top here where it's not as conspicuous if it was flush with the frame. Now there's two holes in here. Let's get to look at these. There's two holes on this side and on this side. I think this side is just for aesthetics or for balance. For this side here, I think the top hole here is actually for the camera and the bottom hole here is actually for the microphone. Okay, I plug the glasses into Mr. Laptop. We're going to see what's happening here with the uh, audio and video quality of these glasses. Mr. Laptop, pull it all up. I think that's the best picture. I mean, it is... Uh, It is angled, but it is mainly in focus. All right, now it's time to go ahead and check the video portion. I'll see how that works. Okay, it blinks, then the light goes off. It's recording. Okay, now those, those video files didn't seem to work out too well, so I'm going to try this again. Okay, do I still look like a nerd? I think so. Okay. Let's see how I look as a nerd on Mr. Laptop with these glasses on. Now it's recording. Okay, it seems you just want to record two seconds of video and then uh, it just freezes. Okay, for the most part, these glasses are okay. They do a halfway decent job with the photo. As for the video though, uh, they don't do a good job. They're recording only two or three seconds and the video is very grainy 
and obviously it moves around a lot because of the position of someone's head when they're moving. I really don't like these, but I'm going to check online and see if there's anything that I'm doing wrong. I'm going to reread the instructions here again. Overall, I'm not too happy with these. I mean, they, they sound like a good idea, but they're just not working out that well. So, I'm just not pleased with it. I'm going to keep checking it out, and I'll see what I can find out here. So, for the meantime, these are going to go in their little case here that came with the package. I have to give this guy positive feedback. What he had listed in the uh, eBay buying, purchase, whatever they call it, was in there. So, even though I was a little surprised about this, he did send everything that was supposed to be there. I have to give him the positive feedback for it, but I'm not happy with the purchase at all. It, I guess it does happen, but I will let you know. So, on the plus side, I do get this nice cleaning cloth. Ooh, nice and soft. So, anyway, that's what I have for this episode here, this video. Um, you get to go ahead and do what you got to do here. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Any feedback you have, any comments or questions, go ahead and put them down below. And remember, keep it rated E for everybody. So, until the next time we meet again, I'm going to say 7-3.